Tampa's sizzling temperatures gave many an unexpected early taste of summer. CBS 2's Candace Crone is live in Woodland Hills now with how people cope with today's intense heat. And Candace, first, how are you coping? <laughs> Oh, Pat, it has been a long time since it's been this hot. And I live in the valley. I just forgot how hot it gets. People here say that, you know, they're used to it, just not this early in the year. I take a look, though, across the street at the temperature gauge. Uh, right now, it is 92 degrees, a few degrees cooler uh, than our last report. Uh, uncomfortable for some, but a treat for others. This one's a strawberry, but I usually get the razzmatazz. Daniela Arbizu couldn't wait to take a sip of her smoothie on one of the hottest days in Woodland Hills so far this year. Jamba Juice was busier than normal as unseasonably warm temperatures had people searching for relief. I'm actually um, 17 weeks pregnant, so it's even worse. And we're from Ventura County, so we're not used to it being this hot. Summer got here early, I guess, you know? It's hot all over Southern California. Workers broke a sweat, keeping up with back to back orders and helping customers chill out which proved to be somewhat of a challenge, especially in a pandemic. Already from like 11 a.m. we start getting like people coming in and they all want to like get their drinks and lots of water is being sold. We can only have six people in the store. Sometimes that kind of gets overrun and it's hard to like kick people out. It felt even hotter for this construction crew working on a newly paved road under the blazing sun. Marcus Cooper took his dog for a walk early, knowing they wouldn't want to be out during the hottest part of the day. I don't like the heat. I'm just glad that we got a pool, but they're heated pools, so it really doesn't make a difference. With the heat comes increased fire danger, as much of Southern California is facing severe drought conditions. Folks we spoke with said, with temperatures already this hot in spring, they're bracing for an even hotter summer. It did come early, you know, it's not usually this hot, you know, this, this soon. Now the heat is expected to stick around well into the evening, but we are in for a cool down through the weekend. Live in Woodland Hills, Candace Crone, CBS 2 News. Pat, okay. back to you. Candace, thank you. Get out of the heat.